turkey in front of us. I'm not sure if that it looks like a hen. Let's see if we can sneak up on. There's a. I don't have any of my turkey calls or anything with. Toms around. Shoot, I'm not even seeing her anymore. Yeah. Trying to make my way over to the, the tower. down in the comments if because I, I did a lot of exploring before I started letting it um uh, didn't edit out certain parts. Um, do you wanna see the whole hunting process, the whole stalking the animals, or would you just want me to you know like find the animals and then start recording? and uh, go from there. Let me know in the comments. You want to see the whole process of trying to find the animals? Like walking through the woods. It, it's a beautiful game. So it's not like, you know, we got really pretty scenery walking through the woods and stuff like that. Uh, trying to find the animals, but do you want, or do you just want me to edit out all of the stalking part, looking for the animal part, and take in just have the hunting part and then what I can do is if I do the whole stocking part then I'll make a short of the hunting you know let me know in the comments of what you want to see do you, do you enjoy the ooh, 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 what do we got got a moose how far away is he Oh, I'm out of boost spray. yet. I was informed that I was using the wrong arrows, I guess. I, I'm not sure which ones we're supposed to use. This is the arrows that I'm using. Let's take a look at our inventory. Uh, the arrows, ammunition, uh, let's see, 420 grain, broadhead, not sure which ones we're supposed to use for this bow. Oh, oh, oh.
yeah, he might not. Might not go down. the the blood trail were more more like in uh the um, what's the other hunting game um that I play um way of the hunter it does more of a blood splatter kind of it not just blots it actually leaves a trail that would be really cool if they did that in this game that would add to the realism. Fifty 
75. If you're wondering where I'm reading that, it's up in the corner. The if you look in the right-hand corner, see it says Blood Trail 5075 Health. Pretty sure that's what that means. See, now that one's got me going back this way again. Let's try this trail. <laughs> he kind of did some juking and janking, huh? anymore. He might have recovered. This is actually the same one anymore. Kind of or it just did recover. They do recover in the game, I think. See, that's, <laughs> that's the trail he's taking me on. Well, it looks 
like it should be the same one. Unless it kept going that way, but I'm pretty sure this is the way it went, but I, it must have, uh... Yeah, see, no or organ... Uh... No organs hit, so... Now I'm not finding a new trail. Now let's run along, let's run up here this way, see if we can spot a I guess we're back on our trek to the tower. That <laughs> kind of was a little bit of a sidetrack, huh? <laughs> I have done that too, where it was like a couple days later. Ooh, 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 where is that? Shoot, I missed it. Oh, okay, yeah, well, let's go check out the tower. It's one of our missions. right over here. On the corner of right up there. I was on my way to the tower when I came across him. Where's the oh it's another head. Where's that coming from? Shoot. It's not like a moose.
This valley is an amazing all-round hunting area, both for new and pro hunters. Rivers, lakes, uplands, forests, mountains. There's lots of different biomes and all kinds of game. Pro tip, if you need to get your bearings, try to find lookouts when you're out exploring. They're scattered all across the reserve. I can't wait to introduce you to my little slice of paradise. And I can only encourage you to wander off and discover the reserve on your own. Hmm, let's see, where should we go? Should we go ahead up this? That might take some... Look, if you're good to go, I... I have a mission of the utmost importance for you. I need someone I can trust to collect maple syrup. You heard me right. Maple syrup. <laughs> Should you choose to accept this mission, I shall share my best kept secret with you. My favorite maple syrup spot. More details will be shared with you in due course. Your objective? An area located near the river flowing east to west, right between the mountain ranges. I've marked it on your hunter mate. Godspeed. Portable tree sand. Did I set that up and not take it down? Oh, I must have. Yeah, because when I shot that... I'm sure you think it's here. weird that I'm asking you to pick up maple syrup. <laughs> I know. Talk about New England cliché. Uh, let's see, can we fast travel here? Yeah, let's do it. While we're on the topic of cliches, did you know the white-tailed deer is one of New Hampshire's living insignia? It's also one of our most popular species among hunters. So, if you like hunting white-tailed deer, feel free to take part in our challenge. Can't wait to see you in action. Okay, yeah, what's the challenge? There's the maple syrup. We'll accept it. And spot four white-tailed deer. Silver or better. Okay, we'll just put all of them on and use them as we can. Um, should I? Yeah, this must be the stand I put up. Nope, he said he was going to mark the maple, spur maple syrup spot. I don't see it, unless this is it. We'll find our way back to our uh, to that tree stand. I've been walking in wilderness as long as I can remember. Me and my father, we basically lived outdoors. I'd get to know every species, every specimen, learn what they eat, where they sleep, how they feel. At the end of the day, you gotta respect all creatures, especially the ones you hunt. The first time I came here, I was 19. I worked here as a seasonal ranger one summer, and I just fell in love with the place. I was lucky they offered me a full-time job as a ranger. Flash forward 20 years, and I'm head warden. Funny how life can be sometimes. I'm originally from the Pacific Northwest. I was born and raised in the Layton Lake District Reserve. Rings a bell? Yep. Exactly. That same reserve you visited back then. This probably gives you a big clue as to who my surprise guest is. Fair warning, though. He can be a little gruff and reserved. Unless you get him started on black bears or unethical hunters, then he won't shut up. His name? Carlton Locke, a.k.a. My old man. Everyone always calls him Doc. Even my mom. I never understood why. We're still looking for a coyote. We need four of them. I think we tracked tracked the deer across. 
across here. Huh, a quail. Bob White quail. Wow, that's pretty. Very picturesque. be just on the other side of that ridge. surrounding me here. Oh yeah, there it is. I'll eventually come across the other one. saw a bigger one over this way. Oh, it's a female. Yeah, that's a little male. Yeah, that's a nice 
nicer one. I think I'm going to go with the gun this time. Oh, there's another female too. So I'm like splitting the herd. That's the other thing I love about this game is that it actually has them gathering together. Okay, that's a, a two. Oh wow. <laughs> um hello. <laughs> oh, it's like they're surrounding me here. <laughs> oh man, where's that big guy going? He's the one I want. These guys are the ones surrounding me, though. <laughs> That's whitetail spray, but... but if you keep attacking me it just might have to happen <laughs> I just had to put off a warning shot or he might have tra she might have trampled me nuts that just scared him all away That's where I should probably have a pistol on me too. Then I can shoot warning shots and not <laughs> or like a bear spray. I don't know if do they offer bear spray in the game? Yeah, so I did put this must have put this stand up there and, and take it down. Yeah, this is where I ended at, and I, uh, yeah, okay, uh, that's where it was, I, I had ended here, and it, did, it transports you back to the main lodge. Okay, well, I think that's where we're going to leave off in this episode. Fortunately, we didn't get anything, but that's the way it is to, for hunting. You don't, you don't always get <laughs> you might see, but you might not get. <laughs> okay, well, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I uh, hope you have a great rest of your day. Um, it's my birthday today, so I'm uh, going to make a couple videos and maybe go out and get something to eat for, for dinner tonight. And I might make a cake for myself. I think I've got a cake mix in there, so... Okay, well, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I appreciate all of your time you put into watching my videos and your sub your sub subscribing and your thumbs up and, you know, anything you do is always appreciated. Have a great rest of your day.